for this. I mean, I can't lie. Why I fired I Loshan? Problem number one is that you eat cheese. <laughs> Never on time when we come off a of home time. Loshan will set a time to be back to the truck and miss it every single time. Number two, he's a compulsive, he has a compulsive disorder. If, when he switches, he has to literally spray the whole front, front end down with disinfectant. Number three, not focus. He more worried about that satchmo than making that money. You understand? I'm a runner. He said, no matter. I get behind the wheel, that go the deal. You know what I'm saying? Everything's done. We we get things done. Are you eating cheese, almonds, and ham? Like all this is protein and rich stuff, man. That's what it is. You get you a protein shock right here. Portable protein pack. Up your protein, up your potassium. Neutralizes your um your uh 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 the hormone insulin, which starts to let your body to let go of some of the weight. I'm insulin resistant. You gotta stay woke. Another thing, he ain't never woke. You understand? This cat ain't never woke about nothing. You know, he's borderline cooling. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> well, I don't put it out there. Um, number five, he always stealing people's glasses. Um, you can help me think of something else. I'm letting you finish before I even. I, I want you to get it all out. Get it all out your system. He light skin, you know what I'm saying? Oh, uh, I think that's that's the reason why I'm firing you, though. Are, are, you, are you done? Hmm? You done, boss? Yeah, this is his last trip, y'all. I know we done said it before. That's this for real. He, he get his truck and not his ass out of here. So uh, I must have blinked that far out, but he got to go. <laughs> he ain't got to go home. But he got to get up out of here. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I didn't have it. I'm, it's over. It's over. All right, man. Always ducking work. <laughs> okay. All right. Let me know when you done. I'm done. First, I'm going to start off and say that those Oakleys that you're wearing are mine. Yours are somewhere lost. Okay. 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 You, want, you want me to put it over here? They want to hear you loud. Close. All right. First, I want to say thank you to everybody who has subscribed to my channel from off of Trucker Brown's channel or that follow Trucker Brown, I appreciate that. Zoom, you see what I'm saying? Cause I'm a, I'm a humble dude, okay? So I wanna, pre I appreciate everybody who has started following me, either it be Instagram at LaShawn Parks or it was on Facebook, sending me a friend request, LaShawn Parks, or uh, you subscribe to my YouTube channel which is Trucking with LaShawn Parks. I appreciate all y'all, okay? I like how you just slip that's, that that's plug first, in there right, in the yeah. middle of you talking. That's first. I, I thought you was done. You got, got, got to finish what I got to say, boss. Uh, you can right. some of this veg smoothie? No, I'm good. Thank you. Enjoy. All right? You I see, try to you, share. You see how humble I am. So, next I want to say that I taught Trucker Brown all the securement on this truck. He had no idea how to secure a vehicle prior to coming. Okay? You'd put a vehicle up in his face, he would have ran opposite direction, okay? I remember the first day when he tried to drive the vehicle up on the ramp, he was shook daddy, okay? We, we, I, don't know, I don't know if we got that on camera, but he was shook daddy, okay? That was what he was. He was scared as hell, okay? The next thing is, the shades that he's rocking right now are my shades, okay? I'll tell the show now, you right now. I want to go ahead and say this. I did sell him a pair. I had three, I had three pair of Oakleys, okay, people? I got a pair of Oakleys on right now. He got my other pair of Oakleys that my father gave me, me actually. These no, my dad gave me those. I would my never let you get them. you said when you got off the truck, nope, you was going to nope, let me have nope, these jokes, No, nope. I never said you could get the ones that my dad gave me when I came in the truck. He gave me those for graduating and getting my CDL. You know what? You're right. You so I need to get those Let back. me get them up off you, then. You will definitely not get these that I paid two fifty good for. All right? See, you see what I'm saying? He's stingy, son. Back, I'm back what I'm saying. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Me can't give you that, okay? Let me get the headache rack. I see what I'm saying? So, <laughs> <laughs> see what I'm saying? It ain't working out. You see what I'm saying? I can't get it out you. I'm sorry. You it know it I need it, it, dog. Hey, hey. You see so, how you do it? <laughs> so, I sold him a pair of my third Oakleys for, for super dirt cheap, okay? I sold them to him for $50, okay? Those are $150 pair of Oakleys, but that's that's my brother. 
You know what I'm saying? So I look out. You, you want a pair of shades, a high quality pair of shades? No problem. $50, they're yours. Bad, bada bing, bada boom. Boom, you got them. Who I put you on the Oakley? You didn't. You never had a, owned a pair of Oakleys until you met me. All right? Now, that's the second thing. Third thing, you can't fire somebody that's quitting. Okay? Uh, I already got paperwork. No, now you don't have no paperwork. I got paperwork on you. You, you got nothing. Your, your official re, uh, uh, release from Truck Brown Transport for insubordination. Insubordination. Time mismanagement. Time mismanagement. And, and, and misappropriating company funds. Misappro comp mi how did I misappropriate company funds? That gambler. That was my walk around one. And you misappropriated it. That's my money. Like that that's my money. Like I I could I could literally go throw it in the strip club, chasing Andrew Jackson, what up? And, and make it rain on them. Number, another thing you did too, man. You got too many subs. I ain't think I, I ain't want to give you that many subs, dog. Cause they see the genuineness. They see the humbleness. I only wanted to get you about about a stack, dog. You done got off about thirty five hundred. Plus, low is a funny dude. Okay, and you know that's what it's about. I, I keep them entertained. Someone told me that they gonna stop watching if we split up a team. Hey, they gotta do what they gotta do. They only watch for us to be team. Hey, that's cool. One lost subscriber. I hey listen, here go here go analytic for y'all. I gain 30, 40 subscribers a day. So if I lose one, I still gain 39. So if anybody don't want to watch it no more, it's cool. That we ain't they don't want to watch no more that we're teaming. Channel is gonna both channels is gonna continue to go on. Like <laughs> regardless of how many people may drop off or how many people may come, it's gonna continue to go. So tell me what you think the videos are gonna be about. Us splitting up, like what? What you know? They're gonna be looking into our situation and coming up with these stories. What do you think is gonna be the closest to? Well, I think that the uniqueness that's gonna happen on Trucker Brown's channel that you guys will get to see and should be enjoyable is, yeah, I taught him all of the the way that our carrier runs and and how to secure these loads. But still, he's still gonna when he's out on his own, he's still gonna have that jitterbug. Okay, he's still going. It's still gonna be like, all right. Low ain't here. It's still going to still going to kind of be like a learning curve for him. So I would continue to watch it because you guys are going to see his his ups and his downs and still his learning curve of being solo no, and, and having to do no, that. No, I'm talking about what do you think they're going to say we actually split up for? Uh, they're probably going to you probably going to hear stuff that Low was tired of him. Uh, Trucker Brown, two egos in a truck that can't get along. Uh, these two guys got too big of egos for one truck and or you're gonna hear some probably the home erratic stuff oh low got tired of getting booty booty boo all that stu <laughs> yeah, stupid stuff I'll okay leave that one alone. the thing is this none of that happened none of that anybody who thinks like that first of all we're growing at we're grown adults you're thinking immaturely okay I would expect that to come from a uh, my child, 16, one of my 12-year-old, 14-year-old kids. But for a grown adult to say that, it just shows your maturity level, and you're not on, you're not, you're not mature yet. You still, you still got some growing to do. And it's a shame that at the age of, average age, of people that watch us is 25 and and higher. That uh, you guys are still immature. Real, real talk, real rap. But uh, none of that transpired. The thing is, this, if you guys have been following the channel from the beginning. This was all planned. We we said this from the from the beginning of the first video that I was getting on the truck, show truck of brownness, and by we actually were late. Yeah. We actually said by July, June, July that the second truck would be coming in. So we're late. Okay, um, that that's about it. But it, it has nothing to do with oh these guys couldn't get along. We knew it, woody woody woody. Because you know that them stories are gonna come. We knew it. We knew it. Uh, I knew we it was gonna get. Right. Fighting, sparring matches. We weren't fighting for control over where the truck went, cause we had all that divided, divided up. Cause we knew that's the main place people. Felt. I said, look, but well, then you just pick where the truck go if you know how the thing works. And I left it at that. Oh yeah. Uh, uh, P.S. I got all his uh his uh broker joints in my phone now. So to the people that say they ain't able to make no money when he gone, I'm sorry. Yeah, and he'll still do good because I mean. He's still like, like he's a brother from we like a brother from another mother. So even if he falls on on something where he doesn't understand, uh, damn, 
getting all kind of bumps. He know that he can still give me a call and, you know, I'll walk him through it, even though I'll probably be aggravated as shit because it's like, yo, I showed you this on the truck, you didn't pay attention. But I still make sure that, that he's that he's squared, that he's squared, you know what I'm saying? So it wouldn't be no issue. But I think that both channels are still going to do extremely well. And uh, as always, new adventures. Now we can double up uh, on big shipments that uh, the brokers have. Oh, I got 10 of these trucks that need to get out of here. You know what I mean? We can, you know what I'm saying? We right. can do stuff like that, double up, cross country, double up. We still got, it's still stuff to do, man. Like, I'm trying to understand, man, this life is forever going. It's forever going. And, and if you ain't trying to live it, that's why you can say, oh, well, this is over. Then you would have said that when I first left Melbourne. You would have said that when I first uh, left Montgomery, when I first went to Prime, when I first went to the uh, thing that helped my father out, and that didn't work out. You would have said, it's never over. Right. Especially if you know how to make content. Which half of y'all that don't know how to make content is why y'all think, oh, well, his whole channel's teaming. No, it's not. We only got about 26 videos a team, and I got 13, I got 1,200 videos. You gotta, you gotta stay woke out here, man. And I will, I guess I'll say this too. A lot of people think that Trucker Brown's gonna fail because I'm not around. Um, truth be told, on camera, Trucker Brown looked tough as a goddamn piece of beef jerky. But the dude is really like, he's a sponge, okay? He, um, he listens and he's not uh, a, a, a person who thinks that he knows it all when it comes to things that he doesn't know. So if I give him advice, he, he takes it. You know what I mean? He's not he, he's not that type of person where his ego is like, nah, I'm, I'm, I'm bigger than this or woody woody woo. He, he really does take advice. I mean, he followed the advice plan that I gave him for Prime and he showed success. And he showed you guys that. So. Y'all gotta know when we joking and when we not. Right. That's where that come from. Right. That's like, they don't understand that we set it up that you run the night. I'm gonna load the truck. And unload the truck, load the truck. You wake up 600 through the night. That's how we planned it. But since we used it as a joke to throw back and forth, they actually feel like, oh, well... Low doing all the work. Like yeah. y'all got, and it's to the point where it kind of get out of hand. Yeah, yeah I mean, yeah. some of this stuff is just joke. We just joking around, man. Y'all got to take it so serious. I mean, he been driving for four years, been doing flatbed for what three? So, and I'm a runner. It's just, I mean, it's nothing new to him. I, you know, the only thing I had to do was show him how the paperwork is ran here and pretty much how to secure the vehicles. Pretty much, uh, that's it. But I, I know the fundamentals of security. Right. Okay, I know the fundamentals of it. That's like if someone teaching you about weightlifting, they ain't gonna teach you a new curl. But you know the fundamentals of how to breathe and all that stuff already. I know how to work chains, I know how to put them up, I know how to put them on. So I may call and say, okay, with this bus, where did you secure it to? Look under there, the cross beam. That's all I need to know. Go under there, hook it to the cross beam, bam. He ain't gotta tell me how to put the uh, ratchet how you put the ratchet and you know you gotta do all of that that's what i'm saying a lot of y'all if y'all sit back and learn and just enjoy the content and actually take from it it wouldn't be so much um misunderstandings i mean this is true so you want that is i'm good on that bro but i got it got strawberries in there too uh, that's all you all right but Moral of the story is, uh, he got to go. I got to go. I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to getting the second truck started, which the second truck, uh, it's all part of the plan of the YMG. All part of the so plan. We got we to gotta get it started. We got to get it moving. We got to get the ball rolling. So, you know, yeah. That's it. We already, oh yeah, another thing too, man. You got to go to my Instagram. I don't understand why y'all not on my Instagram. Today, I'm gonna snap, Insta snap, my whole day. My whole day, from the beginning of my drive ship to the end of it. You, that's, that's 43 something small videos that you're missing. My Insta snap is averaging about three, 400 views a snap. You're missing out on content, man. My live feeds on there is going up to three, 400. You're 
you're missing out on content, man. I can't do everything I want to do on, on YouTube. That's why you need to come over to the IG because I can be my unrestricted. Okay? That's all I'm saying. How you find me on IG is at Trucker Brown. That's it. All you do is type in Trucker Brown in the IG and I'm pop up. Follow me. We're going to have some fun, man. Then you have uh, Instagram. Like, low, low. Of course you would act like you didn't know. No, I don't remember. My Instagram was. is at Loshawn Parks. Type in LaShawn Parks on everything. Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, and I'll pop up. Do I don't got no Twitter. I don't got no Snapchat. So. Do you be posting like that? That's my problem. I'm going to be posting a lot more on Instagram when I get in my truck. Because I have more downtime. More downtime. So. So, expect more content when we separate. We out. Yeah. Go on. Y'all be up. I mean, y'all stay up. And uh, continue to support both channels. And uh, we're going to continue to feed y'all content all day. 100 YTTA all day gang bang